Good morning, everybody. It is January 18th, and today is sponsored by nobody, because I don't have any sponsors. It is a Monday, and obviously you can tell it's a manic Monday because I'm still in my jumper. Uh, didn't have time to get dressed today. That's how crazy it was. All right, so here's the deal. I'm gonna go through a couple of bits and bobs that I think are important on my Monday. Thought about them over the weekend. I wanna share them with you. So what we're gonna do is put a timer on the clock. <laughs> All right, first is quotes. I go through quotes, have them up on the walls, inspire me, get excited about life, and here we go. Here's three and I wanna share with you. One, sit with winners. The conversation is different. I truly wholeheartedly believe this. You're sitting with people that are motivated, that are excited about life, that are doing some interesting things. Sit with those guys, chat with those guys, pick up the phone and call those guys. When I say guys, I mean y'all. Um, you're gonna get further, rather than the people who whinge and whine and complain about life. So uh, sit with winners. All right, next. You will never be criticized by someone who is doing more than you. You will only be criticized by someone doing less than you. It speaks for itself, but if you're getting criticized for what you're up to, the projects you're working on, or the dreams you have, or whatever you're up to, just be mindful about who's giving you that feedback. And are they doing more or less than you? If they're doing less, they're probably trying to drag you down. If they're doing more, they're probably gonna be encouraging you to do more. All right, and last quote is, getting shit done is the best way to predict your future. Truth, truth, keep hustling. All right, onward and upward, we've got fun purchases. If you don't know that I purchase a lot of stuff, well, now you do. I like to buy things, things are fun. Uh, toys, uh, consider money, just a bunch of fun tokens, and uh, this is what I bought that I really like this weekend. All right, I bought Rock. It is the heaviest whiskey glass on the market. It is pretty heavy. Roll that video, please. All right, I know that they say it's a whiskey glass, but I think I'm just gonna turn it into a tequila glass. Cause that's more my cup of tea. Tequila, tequila. Look at that. Ooh wee. Get some liquid in there. I can't, it's the middle of the day. It's not five o'clock yet. I'm gonna hold, I'm gonna hold till later. Bosh, favorite word. I know the other day I brought you my word of 2021, which is energy, which is what I'm bringing right now. <gasps> I hope so. And then this one is more of like a life word. It has been a part of my life since the beginning and I never knew what it was until a good buddy of mine brought it to my attention. His name is Nerdin Topham. He's an incredible chef. He's working on a new vlog. And start telling his story about what he's up to, which is pretty cool. But he called me one day and uh, shared this word. This one. Which I'm sure your Japanese is all rock solid and know what that is. But for those who don't, it's called omotenashi. And for me, it has resonated through every single project, every single piece of work I've ever done in my life. Um, and I consider it the secret sauce. And if you don't know what it is, I wanna go look that up. Oh yeah, this little strip, just so I don't go sideways. All right, and I posted the other day, I needed a D-Rock, and I got a lot of questions about what a D-Rock is. A D-Rock is a dude who actually follows Gary Vaynerchuk and creates content. So photos, videos, and the creation of video content. Um, He's great at what he does. It's funny because as I was looking around, there's loads of posts asking for the same thing. But if you know one or are one, let me know. Um, we've got a lot of stuff going on and it'd be nice to have an extra pair of hands, someone who can edit, create content, have a brain, be enthusiastic and get some work done. Um, if you know him or you're one, send it. Comments or shoot me an email at justin at campfire-creative.com. Thanks so very much. All right, and the last quote, which I think is a pretty flippin' good quote. Um, my mom's probably gonna shout at me because it's got a swear word in it. 
but it's this. I'm not even gonna say it out loud. Okay, maybe. Believe in your self because it's important that you believe that where you're going is where you need to be. Because if you're gonna get other people on board, you're gonna need to be enthusiastic, get people involved. And if you don't believe in yourself, nobody else will. That's what I got. That's Monday, Taco Burrito, I'm out. Pick up that phone, call your friends and family. Peace. Ooh, what was the time on that? Yikes, a little bit longer than I thought. Shorter than previous ones. Shorter than previous ones. We'll work on this. We'll get it better. Peace.